Hi and welcome to this edition of Out of the Box. My name is Paul. Today we're going to have a look at what is in this blue box. Uh, yes, another Ruji Ray device. Uh, this one is an access point. It's the RG RAP2200. Um, we have the model that says dash G at the end. Um, there is one that says dash F. So the specs are exactly the same except one major difference. The dash G has a gigabit Ethernet interface. Um, and the Dash F has a 10100. All right, not meant to be a big technical overview, but let me show you what you get in the box. You're going to get the access point itself, which we get to have a look at in a moment. Let me reach down. You are going to get your warranty card. Uh, you've heard me say this before. I love the Ruji Ray stuff. One for it's so, so super simple setup. Just scan the barcode. Uh, once you've plugged it in and it's got internet access, scan the barcode, simple add. Um, to your project and you're off and running. But the other thing on here, warranty, three years plus warranty. Fantastic, in some of the switches, this five year warranty. So really good warranty card worthwhile there. And you're gonna get your get started guide, which is gonna show you uh, everything you need to know about the device itself. All right, this then will come with a um, hard wall or ceiling um, mounting uh, bracket there. Let me just lift that up so you can see it. Um, and you will have a uh, packet of screws there and lugs uh, to fix that. Um, I will just show you quickly um, on the back of the unit here, um, you do have these um, four stoppers. Uh, the idea very simply, our plate is going to be mounted. Uh, if we just imagine we mounted this on the wall um, and we can then simply, he says making sure he's got this right the way up, so mounted on the wall, we can then just literally bring this into place and clip it into place. Imagine you've done that on the ceiling again, you'd just be able to clip it back into place that way round. So you're going to get that. And then obviously, like I said, you're going to get the device itself. Now, no, there's no PoE injector in the box. Um, this can be powered, which I'll show you in a minute, by 12 volts or PoE, it's uh, 48 volts PoE. So you will need to buy an injector with it, or maybe you've already got a, a 48 port PoE switch that you can use. So let me just hold the device up there for you. Probably not a lot you can see in the light and the shine. Uh, side profile there, uh, really slim line, well built. Um, on the back here, um, obviously, like I said, we have got our pins. We've got our barcode to scan. Um, to be able to add this unit uh, simply and easily um, to the cloud controller. It's a free cloud controller that runs all of this. Um, nothing, no software to install, works with a web browser and an app on your phone, so super easy. All right, then let's just have a look on the bottom here. So we have our main uh, PoE in, all right, um, where I just check, oh, yeah, we're gonna have over here first, we've got our 12 volts in. Uh, fantastic if you have got this at a solar. Uh, end or something like that. You've only got 12 volts. Great solution straight out of the box. Easy to use. We then have our um, first uh, Ethernet port. Uh, remember, this is the one gig model, the one that has a G at the end. If this was the one that had F, then you only got a 10100. Um, that is going to take your PoE in to power it. You can actually run the 12 volt and the um, PoE at the same time, um, and they will do a failover. So uh, there is something useful there in due course. And this is your second um, Ethernet port. No PoE on that, but your second Ethernet port. And we've got our reset switch over there. That is really the unit and everything that you get. Um, off the top of my head, this does in the 2.4 gigahertz band around about 400 megasecond. And in the five gigahertz, it does around about 867, I think. Um, so a fantastically priced, well uh, uh, positioned product, simple to set up, no licensing needed, fantastic warranty, uh, really good coverage. So hopefully that's been useful. That's the Ruji Ray -E, RG RAP 2200. This is the Dash G model. Head on over to our YouTube channel. We've got loads more box openings on wireless networking and firewalling devices. So do subscribe and stay up to date.